all my seekers welcome back welcome back welcome back to the channel welcome back to the channel I, it's always a pleasure to have you back here today's reading is for Aries Aries welcome to your reading and it's a love reading all right but please know that if it doesn't resonate please don't get hurt or in your feelings that only means that today is not for you it might be for another Aries otherwise you can always come back and that reading might be just for you all right also, if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, feel free to do so and turn on your post notifications so you always know when I upload brand new content. Please also give the video a thumbs up because when you thumbs up the videos, YouTube see that you like the videos and they will push the videos out there into a much wider audience and the channel will grow. And that's what we want to do here, right? We want to grow. Now, also, honey, for all my returning seekers, know that I love you so, 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 so much. Thank you for all your love and support. My seat, I'm in love with so big up on yourself. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Now, please know that the cards has been shuffled and the cards has also been blessed. However, uh, before I get into all my readings, I always like to pray first, asking the Lord to send down his most powerful angels to guide over my every words and the messages that I share with you, my seekers, and for those that needs to know. So let's get started. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send down your most powerful angels to take charge, giving me the right words and the messages that you need me to share with my seekers for those who need to know. Heavenly Father, I give you all the honor, all the praises. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. All right? So, Aries, this is a love reading. It could be past, present, or future. Whatever you're going, what's going on in your um, love life, your relationship, you know, where you want to know, if you need to move on, if love is coming your way, we're going to find that out right now. Maybe you walked out on a relationship. Maybe somebody walked out on you. You want to know what's going on, why they walked out on you. So, we're going to find, we're going to get to the root of the problem. We're going to get to the root of the nitty gritty, okay? So have an open mind. And again, if the reading does not resonate, don't get hurt about it. Just come back and the next one might be just for you, okay? All right, so angels, let's get to work. Let's get to work for Aries. Find out what's been going on, why they're feeling so down these days. We're going to pull a total of about um, eight cards. But if you want me to pull more cards, just use me as your vessel and just take me in the direction that you need me to go, okay? Angel, let's go. Let's get to work. Let's get to work. Four cards, please. Four cards, please. All right. Thank you. All right, your first card. All you do is complain about what I am not doing. Right. So now I'm taking control. Okay. All you do is complain about what I'm not doing right. So now I'm taking control. All right? So it's obvious that there is a relationship here, all right? And that, that person was just complaining. Everything that you did was not done the way that they wanted you to do it. But simply because they were just making excuses. Excuses after excuses, all right? They had other plans. So whatever you did wasn't good enough for them, all right? And they always kept complaining about what you were doing. The angel said, now you're my ex, and baby, that's all you're going to be. Remember, you left me. Don't come back. This is a past relationship. This relationship has already ended, okay, Aries? Someone left. And honey, you definitely don't want them back because you're over it. Because while you were with them, they never appreciated you for being you. Everything that you did, everything that you said, they complained about it. Nothing was good enough for them, all right? You left this love really fast. My heart is not a toy. So stop texting me. And now they're texting you, okay? Trying to play games with your emotions and your feelings. Texting and calling and spying on your, on your social media. That's all you're doing right now. Playing games because that's, that, that's what they do best. There's no more me and you. When you left, I thought I could never trust again. So they broke your trust. 
they did something here to you that you felt like you could never trust anyone again. Your heart was broken into so many pieces. Aries, I'm telling you, you was broken. When this relationship ended, you were broken. You felt like you couldn't date anyone ever again because you had given so much of yourself to this relationship. Let me have um four more cards, please, angels. And thank you so, so much. Four more cards. Let's see what's going on with this relation. This relationship has definitely ended for sure. All right? You wanted to have your cake and eat it all by yourself. Now I hope you're full, all right? So they were being very selfish in the relationship. They were so, so, so selfish. All they thought about was them and only them. They didn't care about nothing you had to say. Your opinions was irrelevant, all right? And they made you f feel so bad, so bad and so hurt. You're all about yourself. See, they're all about themselves. What have you done for me lately? They did nothing for you. Absolutely nothing. All they did was bring you grief and pain and hurt. That's all they did. I'm not here for just a moment. My love for you was true. You took me for a fool. Now go get that karma. Karma is on the way, honey. Karma is on the way. Are, as a matter of fact, karma has already came their way. Because now they're trying to text you. Okay, they've been trying to reach you. They've been spying on your, your Facebook page and trying to see who you're dating now. All right. The angel said, I'm not crying over you anymore. You're not worth any of my time. All right. You're over it. You are so over it. You're so done with it. They are out of your life. All right. Don't take them back. Don't even answer any of those texts. But they have been spying on you, Aries, from a distance. They're shame. They're out of shame. They're, they're, they're like, so they see that you've like gotten over them and they just cannot understand that you have gotten over them. And so they're trying to text you, trying to play games, but you know what? They didn't change their spot. A leopard doesn't change their spot series. They're still the same old, same old. And if you decide to fall into their trap and take them back, they're going to go back to being them. them oh, angels are popping cards out here. They're going to go back to being them, their same ugly self, all right? So don't take him back in your life at all. Let's have um, four more cards, and then we'll end your reading here, Amy. See what's going on. See what time it is for you. Engagement. The engagement card came up. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. So someone as either came in your life, are about to come into your life. New love is about to come into your life if it has not already. And it's looking good from my end here. All right? Worth waiting for. Love is worth waiting for. Everything that you've hoped and dreamed for is worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your life. Okay? So big things are coming your way. Your love life is going to be one of a million. All right? Oh, yeah. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning in your life. This person that is texting you, this past right here, that's the one you have to be careful for. Be very careful, all right? Because when this new love comes in your life, they're going to want to show up and start problem and conflict. But remember, a leopard never changes their spot. The angel said, make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guiding to take, all right? Great love, okay, is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. The angels are guiding you with this new love here that's coming into your life. All right? New love is coming your way, for sure. But be careful of the ex. All right? The ex is trying to show up. They will show up. They are definitely going to be showing up in your life, texting you and telling you, let's, baby, let's, let's do this again. You know, we still have love for each other. They are going to try to come back because they're already trying to text you. So be very, very careful. I hope that helped. Please give the reading a thumbs up. I hope it did resonate. And yeah, don't forget, though, always stay prayed up. And remember, seek and you will always find.